Welcome to Illuminati Silver. We tell you the truth about silver. Today is Sunday the 4th of September 2016 and we're providing our gold and silver update for the week ending the 2nd of September. Gold rose in US dollar terms last week by $4 from 1321 to 1325, having hit a high of 1327 and a low of 1303. In sterling terms, gold finished the week at £996, that's down £9, and in euros it closed at €1,187, that's up €7 on the week. Silver rose 79 cents from $18.65 to $19.44, having reached a high of 1945 and a low of 1841. In sterling terms, it closed at £14.62. pence. That's up 43 pence for the week. And in euros, it rose 0.77 euros at 17.42 euros per ounce. The gold to silver ratio fell from 70.8 to 1 to 68.2 to 1. The Dow Jones closed on Friday at 18,491, up 72 points on the day and up 96 points on the week. And the Nasdaq closed at 5,249, up 22 points on the day and up 31 points on the week. Brent crude was down $2.63 at $46.83 and US light crude was down $2.76 at $44.33. The dollar index stands at 95.8. That's up 0.3 on the week. Gold, during the early part of the week, fell almost touching the $1,300 level and then recovered quite strongly on Friday by pretty nondescript jobs data. Whilst the Fed has been talking up the prospects of an interest rate rise, The market consensus is that this may now not happen until December, where they see a quarter percent rise occurring. We would not necessarily differ with that opinion as things currently stand. However, of course, we shall know who the new US president will be by that time. And of course, depending upon whether it's Clinton or Trump, will be reflected in markets accordingly. We hope those who were underweighting gold used last week as an opportunity to purchase more, as we suspect that we shall now slowly witness rising prices from here. Silver made up its losses from the previous week, experiencing strong support just above the $18 level and resistance at $19.50. That said, we can see silver move a little higher slowly, perhaps up to $21 again, but we're not expecting any major jump beyond that level currently. We had hoped that silver would have moved slightly closer to the $18 level to enable listeners to buy in if they were underweight. We suspect that now traders are back in harness, that $19 will become more the norm for now. We promised our subscribers that we would produce a video on platinum and our thoughts on this metal. And this will be forthcoming towards the end of this week. We hope you have found this video interesting and informative. And if so, please give it a thumb up and share it on Twitter. Also, kindly visit our website at IlluminatiSilver.com. And if you haven't already done so, please subscribe as a free member for regular email updates and offers. Our Facebook page, which is updated regularly, can be found at facebook.com forward slash Illuminati Silver. Disclaimer. Illuminati Silver owners come from a background of banking, international wealth management and economics. Having now retired from these worlds, we are not qualified to give investment advice. Therefore, this and other productions must not be deemed to be giving such advice and merely represent the personal views.